Hey guys, welcome to the Mountain Bear Show. Bear talk number 57, I think. I like 57. 57, what do y'all think? I like it. Oh, wow. But anyhow, I think there's probably a lot to talk about that I haven't talked about because it's been a quick minute since I've done a video. Oh, wow. That long. Ugh. You know, I, I normally do videos when I have something to say or celebrate or to laugh about or... <laughs> and I really, you know, I really don't. Um, uh, well, I mean, I do have a lot to say. I say it all the time. Um, I, I guess my point, I, I guess what I'm going to talk about right now is Indiana. Hashtag hate state. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. And I know y'all probably saying, you a bitch. You a real bitch. No, 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 no. Not in that sense. I love it. I love it because they're getting out the backlash of this bill that their stupid ass governor signed in the law. My point is, to me, I'm not about to go into a business that don't like me. Why would I want to go and be, uh, I, I guess in a way, told off or put in my place? Because uh, I'm not the one for that. Um, I'm really not. Um, I'm more, you know, somebody says something to me very negative about my sexuality, then, you know, I, I think I'll lose control. Um, my good friend Marco said it great, you know, this one store keeps, or this one restaurant or whatever it is, keeps bragging that, you know, he told this one patron that their equipment was broke down and they wasn't going to serve him, but other people was eating. And he's like, ha, 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 I discriminated against a gay person, basically. What's the name of your restaurant? Bottom line, what is the name of your restaurant? Are you afraid of going out of business? Mm -hmm. I think so. I think so. I think a lot of people... When this starts taking place and take, you know, and it's taking effect, I think a lot of people are going to get hurt in this, and I think it's going to be the residents of Indiana, their taxpayers, because people are not going to start spending their money there. Um, I'm looking for people to go outside that state. Uh, I saw where Angie's listed that they was not going to expand. It was either 18 or 44 million dollar expansion that hangs out in my head. <clears throat> I'm not for sure. Don't quote me on that. But Angie's um, Angie's list, I will say this. Virginia is open for business. Yes. Hashtag Virginia is for lovers. Yes, we will take y'all's business. Richmond, perfect area. Um, you know, and you know, when companies start leaving the state, look at other states around or hey Virginia over here. We need jobs. We need jobs. Bring your asses over. We got a very cool Democratic governor. Awesome. And uh, I think we could do business. How you doing? Yeah, that's what I like. Um, but no, saying that, I kind of feel really bad for the, the people in Indiana as a whole. Not just the gays, but everybody. Because it's, you know, everybody now is hating on all of Indiana. And it's not all of Indiana. It's the Christian Coalition. And I have said this once, and I have said it twice. I have said it a million times. Tax the fucking churches. They want an opinion. Make them pay taxes. If they don't pay taxes, shut the fuck up and preach. That's the bottom line. Mm -mm. Same way with Pat Robinson. Shut up, Pat. Preach, bitch. Shut up. Don't give me your opinion. Preach what's in the Bible and keep it to yourself. You know, because I think if there was a God, he would not want all this hate in the world. And it is a lot of hate, you know. And most wars were in the name of God. I don't think God is that kind of a vengeful person. But, you know, there are leaders throughout the centuries have made God into a very vengeful person. So, to me, if he did not want people here, why create us? You know, just my opinion. I'm allowed to have one. You like it? I don't care. You do like it? I don't care. Um, I will say this. I will say this because I am not a religious person. I believe once you're gone, you're gone. Um, and you know, that's in a way, it's kind of hard for me to say it because I lost my mom, and I hope to 
I hope she's in a better place. But if not, you know, she lived her life, but her life lives on through me. You know, I, I know what she went through in her childhood because she would talk about it. I know what she went through with having, you know, uh, her four children, the love that she shared, the madness, the good times, all of it. You know, I we all got it from her. So we carry that on with us until our life is over. And then somebody else picks that up. And I think it's, you know, it's the remembrance of it. So that's how a person's life, to me, is carried on through the histories. So... You know, and saying that, I, I, you know, to people and, you know, my gay friends that believe, I'm happy for you. You know, I, I'll give you, I'll put you in my thoughts. I won't pray for you because I don't pray. I don't pray, but I, I have good thoughts. But again, I'm a very spiritual person in that sense. I don't know if that makes sense or not, but that's just me. I, I believe in creation. Yes. My fat ass swam out of the ocean and started walking. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, I started walking, swung on a tree, then, you know, came on from there. I don't know. What are you doing? How are you doing? But uh, also, um, I, I wasn't going to talk about this, but I guess I will. That plane crash that happened over in the French Alps. Um, with the German pilot it has been said everything from he was bisexual depressed and now a terrorist um, I, I'm not going to call him a terrorist because if he was a terrorist he would have tried to run the plane into something um, besides a mountainside I think he was a very disturbed person um, and, uh, you know, everybody wants to throw in their hat on this and what they want to say, think, feel, or whatever. I, tabloids will fuck your mind up when you want to know something. Um, to me, I think uh, the government of Spain and uh, Germany will both figure out what went wrong and go from there. Um, for now, let's just keep it as an accident that happened. Um, especially for the families that lost people. They need a peace of mind. And all this shit coming out about it is not a peace of mind. It draws hate, guys. It's hate that this fam that these families will end up pulling for one another about what happened. You know, what if this happened? What if this happened? What, what, what? If I could have, would have, should have, would have. Um, you know, not good, not good, not good at all. At all. So... Hmm. So, what else is going on? I really don't know. Um, I'm, I I had a birthday party over the weekend for my brother. And my whole family came up to celebrate it. As I was cooking outside on the grill, in the snow, it snowed up here Saturday. I fell down twice. Um, I actually hurt myself. Uh, just get my knee up real bad and I jarred my back. I have no idea why I fell. And everybody's like, what's going on? Are you okay? I'm not drinking. Not drinking. I'm not on no drugs. Ugh, wish. Um, <laughs> but no, I was sober and I had no kind of uh, chemicals in my body. I just, I just fell. And um, so anyhow, I've been laying up in bed trying to take care of that. Today's like the first day I've actually been up to go outside. Um. That's why I'm wearing a sweatshirt and it's 51 degrees. So this is kind of awkward. Um, I thought it was cold, so I don't know. Um, let's see. Yes, I'm watching parts of Ru RuPaul's Drag Race. Am I into it this season? No. Do they have a standout? No. Um, maybe Miss Fame. Notice I said maybe. Uh, uh, there's not a Bianca Del Rio on that show or a Jinx Monsoon or Sharon Needles. I will say that. Um, so, uh, I haven't been keeping up with it that much. Uh, let's see. What else is going on that I can talk about? Um, anyhow, the video is about 10 minutes. Uh, just a reminder, Indiana, 
when your companies start leaving, I hope they start looking into Virginia. We need jobs. Um, we're for lovers. Hey, we're open for business. Yes. Yes, we are. Anyhow, I hope everyone has a good day. And uh, I'll do another video real soon. Big hugs all around. Much love. Mwah. Bye.